everyone, our chairperson, the distinguished uh, panelists, in particular, Sanshri uh, Raymond, Captain uh, Yusuf, uh, Sengyao, Tichang, and Tony. I want to, in particular, to express my appreciation for Captain Yusuf, despite his birthday, deciding to come here. When I invited him to this uh, forum, he didn't tell me that tonight was his birthday. He shows, uh, like you all, your concern for this, what I call the ripoff. The 12.5 billion ringgit, what kind of free zone ripoff. The scandal of all scandals. Bigger than the multiple trial finance scandal that was 25 years ago. That was 2.5 billion ringgit ago. The bigger in currency now, but it's about five times. Five times. And when the, I went to the Parkland Authority Library to look at the apprentices, which was not the next public, together with Tony and others, when I looked through those documents, I was a sense of outrage. What I thought was a can of worms was actually a swarm of crocodiles. <laughs> Uh, those who say the fox, PKMZ, uh, is what clan prop zone. <laughs> there are those who say the PKMZ is actually what clan death zone. I think it's an utter disgrace that uh, this has happened. And to, to next, the uh, forum shows that Malaysians are concerned. And uh, there's an attempt to steal the next thunder. That's why the minister has made a very important announcement today to uh, steal tonight's thunder to show that something is being done. I agree with Sanshri. We must uh, give credit where credit is due. And that was why I publicly praised on TK when the report was made public. I praised it. You follow my blog, you see it. I praised it. But then, when I saw what it was in the report, I felt that he was less than being honest and frank, and I did not share Sanji's view that he's walking the talk. He's running away from the walk and the talk. And I will say to you, a bit why is this so? This, uh, this you see this in tomorrow's paper. This big announcement. What have they done? And I remember this before that. Remember, he was uh, the minister was in Beijing, and he brought from Beijing the road map. The road map to recovery uh, of a PKMZ, which I said I had good people who so I heard the word road map. Because it, it reminds me of the Myanmar military junta road map to democracy, which ended up a road map to nowhere when Aung San Suu Kyi is being further persecuted. And I was afraid that the so called road map of recovery of PKMZ is going to lead to nowhere. And what did he say? This is his block. At this very moment, he was also responding to my daily three questions. <laughs> and I make the daily three questions because the Prime Minister said, ask any question, Aunty Kate will reply. <laughs> Since the Prime Minister has made the offer, how can we don't take it up? So I took it up. Every day three questions, not answered. And uh, you know what he said? At this very moment, professional experts and entrepreneurs have been roped in to provide their views and expertise on how to bring PKMZ back on track for which it was originally conceived. We are not sitting still and playing rhetoric like this is your class. This is what I added. In the weeks and months ahead, my ministry and PKA will put in place a series of action plans to lessen the pain on taxpayers. Series of action plan, and today it is first series plan. And what is the action plan? Form special task force. <laughs> Form special task force. Oh, very high powered task force. As the uh, country mentioned, Transparency International President, you know, is uh, or not one of them. One, one special task force, two committees. These are all fine men, fine gentlemen of uh, established credibility. Uh, like uh, Mr. Vinayak Pradam from Screen and Company to hit the team, 
uh, like uh, others, uh, Lim Chi Hui of uh, another partner of Green, Chin Kwai Fat, managing director, and Lim Sang Pin of uh, uh, Pride Walker House in the past form. And then we have uh, uh, other committees uh, on concrete governance, headed by Dato Paul Lau, the CI president, and other very fine gentlemen. You throw the best, brightest, and the most intelligent into a swamp of crocodiles. What is going to happen? <laughs> Frankly speaking, I pity these fine men. I hope they can survive. Of course, you throw the throw them into the swamp of crocodiles, you can kill, uh, bring it to a book body, and uh, paint the crocodiles fair enough. If not, you will be eaten up by the crocodiles. And want to give notice to all these fine gentlemen, you better be careful, or your good, fine reputation will be destroyed by this. Special task force and the two committees. In in South I I I I I I pick it up. I mean they are great doing a national survey, but I don't know how far they can go. Why? Because I don't think the own TK is being frank and being truthful. I mean he started off by saying it's going to be terrible. Review everything. Because he's not involved. Fair enough. And then uh, we give him a, a full scope to unveil the rot in this Fox and Free Zone scandal. How from 1.1 billion actually started to 002 when Long Stick was a transport minister, it's more than quadrupled to 4.6 billion under Fong Choi, and now 7.5 billion ringgit, heading towards 12.5 billion ringgit. For low sales sum. What is 12.5 billion ringgit? For a local, I think easily it means 10 years amnesty. No need to pay assessment for 10 years. <laughs> Can I know? I mean, 13 years. You're yeah, talking about building universities, uh, say 500 uh, uh, million per university. How many is that? Will be? 125 universities. I mean, for low sales sum. How did it happen? Basically, before I go into that, uh, today, public accounts committee meeting and the uh, senior told us about this. And in this block, TK said he has directed the PKA chairman, uh, Li Huabeng, to submit the report to the MACC and also 40 cents of the report to the PAC members because I actually asked why can't I have a set of the appendices to study? It's not easy to go to to go to the PKA library, a four inch high documents. Quite difficult to be it's not a satisfactory way to examine and scrutinize the documents. So I asked for one set. No no reply, no answer. He says I'm giving 14 sets. I'm directing the PKA chairman to give 14 sets to the uh, PAC members, there are 14 members. They went this morning, he walked in with his people and said, yes, every one of you, the report, this is the report, this is the report which is publicly available, it was put on the, on the website, but tonight it's a bit already, it was two weeks up. The report was put on the website for two weeks, why two weeks? It should be there until the problem is resolved. If it takes 10 years, let it be there for 10 years, correct? 